We've got leaders, leaders of that state, basically saying Trump cannot win. They're supposed to be responsible for counting votes. They're out there basically campaigning, saying that their guy is going to win. It's just a remarkable situation we have on our hands. And it's one thing to lose an election. We have to be prepared for that reality. If we lose based upon real votes that are counted or cast by real people that meet legal requirements, then that is the game. That is the way that it goes, folks. But if we lose because people are fabricating numbers or stuffing ballot boxes or doing other nefarious activities that steal, dare I say, the election from whichever candidate, that cannot be allowed to happen. Why should we even have to make that that statement? Again, think about all the time the Democrat Party has invested in furthering the notion that voter fraud is a myth in this country. What do you mean voter fraud is a myth? Voter fraud is not a myth. Voter fraud is a real thing. People have been prosecuted. People have been convicted of voter fraud. It doesn't mean it's the only scenario. It doesn't mean that Biden didn't somehow win this thing because of the hatred for Trump. And may I ask this question as well? Who's the who are the ones that you know, one of the things that they're trying to do is make you feel guilty for raising these questions. But who are the ones that have invested for four years into the notion that Trump stole the previous election?